How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, play some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. Today is a new ranked season. That's right, we, we completely started a new ranked season today. You can see we are on season 18 now and I was diamond and now I'm platinum too. So we're gonna have to climb back to diamond but before we do that, um, I do want to show you guys some new stuff that I've acquired in the past couple days. So I do have some glory to spend now. We have 13,000 glory now that the season's over. And I think I want to buy Skyforge Mako. Mako is the only legend that I haven't got black colors with, so I don't really have any cool colors with Mako. So while I'm leveling Mako, I figured I might as well look cool while I do it, get some Skyforge colors. I may actually get the Gold Forge as well, I'm not sure. Ah, uh, why not? Let's just get the Gold Forge Mako. <laughs> Gold Forge Mako! Let's go! Alright, so I also got some new uh, Battle Pass items as well that I want to show you guys. I was able to unlock the Cybernetic Beat Isaiah a couple of videos ago. I think I unlocked this when I was doing the Shark Squad video, so that was actually a really fun video. We used three Shark uh, theme legends and Strike Out and made the Ultimate Shark team. And in that video, I got Cybernetic Beat Isaiah. So that's, we're gonna dedicate this video to using this skin because there's only a couple skins in the Battle Pass. And every time I get a Battle Pass skin, I make it a tradition to dedicate at least one video to that skin. And then I also got the uh, Katars. These are all the Synthwave color legends I have unlocked, by the way. Uh, as you can see, I don't even have half of them unlocked, probably. Got kind of an interesting pattern going on there. <laughs> Starting with Zariel and ending with Mirage, kind of a weird shape. And uh, yeah, I got the Synthetic Charge Lance. I also got the Breakdance emote. I got the TV Head Sidekick. So yeah, things are going good. I've been working on the missions a little bit. You know, in between grinding XP for Mako, which doesn't give me missions usually uh, for Mako, but uh, you know, working on the missions. And uh, yeah, we also got equipped. You, some of you may have noticed already. I got some Halloween items equipped. Uh, these are Halloween items from previous years. I got the Pumpkin Pyre, uh, Avatar, the Jack-O-Lantern KO effect. I switched my loading frame back to the Diamond just because. Um, if you want to see, oh, since we're on a new rank season, here's my highest Diamond Emblem. Diamond Emblem Tier 16, which is one less than the highest you could possibly get, uh, which is Tier 17. So there was one rank season where I didn't get Diamond somewhere in the beginning of Brawlhalla. Uh, Unfortunately, but still diamond tier 16 got diamond 16 seasons, so that's pretty cool But I'm gonna leave it on the uh, pumpkin pyre avatar because I like it and I also am using the toil and trouble podium, which is another Halloween Theme podium. I also have the graveyard shift. I could use that one's even older All right, I think we're ready to go. So let's play some uh, games with Isaiah here We're gonna use cybernetic beat Isaiah. Let's look at the different colors. I have for Isaiah right now. I will definitely be making another video with Mako in the future showing off the Gold Forge and uh, the Sky Forge colors. We can go ahead and take a look real quick at all the skins though because I know you guys are probably interested. Here's Orca Mako with the Gold Forged, Abyssal Goblin Mako Gold Forged, regular Mako Gold Forged, and Hammerhead Mako. And then let's look at the Sky Forge real quick. That one actually looks really good man. I almost like the Sky Forge better on some of these. It looks so good. I'm not even gonna lie. The Sky Forge might be better looking. I don't know, man. Maybe I kind of am a little bit regretting getting the Gold Forge now, but that's all right. I like the Gold Forge too. It's just for some reason on Mako, Sky Forge is looking good. All right, let's start with Cybernetic Beat Isaiah. I'm just gonna use default uh, colors and everything for right now. Hope you guys are all having a great day, though, wherever you guys might be. If you enjoy the video, please do me a solid and drop a like. It really helps me out. And if you're playing uh, Rocket League or Fortnite. Any of those epic games, games, definitely please use support a creator code, Lucian's underscore sword. I really appreciate it. Alright, we got our first opponent. Uh, we got a Mordex. I'm not the best with Blasters or Isaiah. I mean, I haven't really played Isaiah in a long time. Since I got him to black colors for the most part, but... We should still be able to play uh, halfway decent here. 
Looks like we're winning the damage battle at least, so that's good. Alright, let's try cannon here. Ooh, that's probably a death. Yep. Look at how cool that cannon looks though on the cybernetic beat Isaiah. That's probably the best part about the skin is the cannon. It looks so clean. Uh-oh, is he? Wait. Oh man, did he give up? Or he just went AFK. I don't really know. Well, oh, he disconnected. Feels bad. All right, let me, uh... Oh my gosh, the bot's actually not bad. Oh, he reconnected. All right, I'll uh, I'll go ahead and KO myself. I didn't realize he was gonna reconnect. I'll at least go to final stocks for him. All right, so he's got a chance. He's still in red. I'm in white, but I'll I'll go down to final final stocks just to make it interesting. Oh, got him with the side stick. GG, dude. I mean. Unfortunate that we didn't get to fight a really good like match there, but you know it is what it is. Sometimes he legs, sometimes it happens. All right, so I need grounded attack, grounded light attack KOs. Interesting. And then uh, blaster KOs, KOs with side air attacks. All right, let's keep going. This time let's use uh let's do charged OG colors. Which by the way, um, I think it's next weekend. The Mammoth Cup is happening, which is a Brawlhalla tournament. And uh, you'll be able to unlock Charged OG Colors as part of the viewership rewards for watching the uh, eSports. But it's the last thing that you unlock, and it's going to take a long time to unlock it. I think they said it takes like 24 hours of watching <laughs> to unlock the Charged OG. But it will be a universal color scheme, meaning you'll have it for every character forever. You don't have to worry about having Charged OG for character anymore. You'll just automatically have it. Oh, those got those uh, blasters look amazing. Oh, snipe. Got him, let's go! This is a diamond I'm fighting too. He's really good, I can tell. Ah, oh, the way that side stick grabs from the top always kind of seemed a little bit cheesy to me, but. I love that lance he's using too. Woo! We are feeling it with cybernetic beat Isaiah today. Don't get too overconfident, man. Anytime you're fighting a diamond, reverse three socks can easily happen. They know what they're doing. They got diamond for a reason. If you're a diamond player, that makes you automatically in the top, like, couple percent of players, probably, so... Congratulations if you got diamond for the first time this, uh, last... ...season. Uh-oh. Yo, Lord Vrax. Lord Vrax is also a really hard person to fight against for me too. Like I did really good this match, but man, sometimes Lord Vrax just destroys me. GG, dude, GG. Hit opponents into armed pressure mines. Oh, that is such a cool challenge. 
That must be the new week, uh, what is that? What are we on, week four? Yeah, new week four challenge. I love that. Oh, I also need spear damage. All right. Well, let's try to hit more people in the mines. That, that's the challenge. That's actually a funny challenge. All right, let's do uh, haunting colors because I am kind of rocking the Halloween uh, outfit right now. So um, I think I'm going to go with the... Uh, ooh, I don't know, man. Should we try a strength stance? It takes away from dexterity, which I don't particularly like, but... I do like hitting hard, so we'll see how this goes. All right, going against uh, Scarlet, base skin. Three, two, one, brawl. I I don't know about you guys, but for some reason it felt. Let's do break dance. <laughs> it felt like this last season of rank just went by so fast. Oh, I thought that. Side Sig would hit him for sure. He's not going into it. I gotta be a little bit better. Oh, the bounce. See, that recovery of mine goes a lot farther and faster than people expect, so I was able to catch him by surprise right there. Really? You're going to challenge me off off stage here instead of getting that weapon, huh? Oh no, he got stage killed. He panic jumped into the bottom of the stage. We all do it. Myself included. Hate to see it happen though. Man, I gave him a wide open chance to take me out when I was holding down that sig. He didn't capitalize. Bad side sig. I knew he was gonna jump there. GG, dude, GG. Pretty fast three stock. Oh, I like his avatar with the boombox. I don't think I have that one. Maybe I do and I just didn't notice. GG, GG. Oh, blaster KOs, all right. So I do need that. Side airs, of course, of course. All right. Uh. Yeah, the strength stance is uh, working out, to be honest. I do have black Isaiah. I guess we should do black colors. I mean, it did. I'm pretty proud that I have black colors for Isaiah. So let's do that. I have black colors for every legend except for Mako now. And I, I've been working on Mako, like I said. My Mako, I think, is level 12. Pretty close to that, if I'm not. Which puts it at about halfway to 25, but not even really, because it takes longer and longer to level up the higher you go, so I'm probably not even halfway. Breakdance. Isaiah versus Sentinel. I was gonna say, he's kind of struggling to even hit me, but he got landed a nice little Qatar neutral. I gotta be careful because if he gets going with the Qatars, he could easily shred me. I gotta say, this skin I'm using looks really good with the black and red colors. Especially the cannon, like I said, the cannon just looks so good. I almost hit him with that second recovery, too. Oh! <laughs> we caught him with the down sig, baby. Nice recovery. Oh!
Oh no, 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 I'm dead. Wow, I died from a neutral air. I think. Oh. Hey, I got to see my TV head uh, topper thing. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Sidekick, that's what they're called, right? He's pushing me. I'll push right back. Push. Push. Yeah. Push right back in your face. GG, dude. GG. Alright guys, well, I think that's going to be it for my cybernetic beat Isaiah. I just wanted to show him off because, hey, it's a new skin, you know? I feel good anytime I get a new skin on the Battle Pass. So, definitely, guys, be sure to subscribe if you want to see more Brawlhalla content. And, uh, yeah, please drop a like if you enjoyed. And, like I said, use creator code Lucians underscore sword in the Epic Game Store. So, for Rocket League or Fortnite or any of those games. And, yeah, this is uh, Lucian Sword. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take it easy, guys.